Crack isolation has become an increasingly common topic in the tile industry, but there seems to be some confusion as to what it really means. ANSI 118.12 provides a product standard for crack isolation membranes that isolate ceramic tile or dimension stone from minor in-plane substrate cracking and thin-set installations. There are a couple important words in that description that we need to review so that you can better understand the capabilities of these membranes and have appropriate expectations. The most important term is in-plane substrate cracking. This means that the crack is only moving horizontally and that there is no vertical or out-of-plane movement. Vertical movement within a substrate crack is almost a guarantee that the crack will eventually transfer through the installation and there is not a standard for protection against this type of movement. The other important term is minor. ANSI 118.12 only requires performance up to a sixteenth of an inch for standard performance and up to an eighth of an inch for high performance grading. Minor cracking in concrete is common and it's often expected due to shrinkage as the concrete dries. But these cracks are different than structural cracking. Only a design professional can determine if a crack is active or dormant, and additionally if the cracking is a result of structural failure. Crack isolation membranes that meet ANSI 118.12, such as Mop Elastic CI or MopaGuard 2, will perform and prevent crack transfer when used in the appropriate settings. But it's important to remember that not all cracks are created equal. For help selecting the right crack isolation membrane for your project, please call us at 800-992-6273 or visit our website.